it is time to put the guns down. Put the guns down. And then we also need to put some prevention things in place as well as a city. We need to put some prevention in place. We need to do some sweeps. We need to uh, look at some of the folks where folks are loitering at and find out what's going on. We need to find out who's selling fentanyl in our communities, who's selling dope, heroin, who's selling crack, and who's selling cocaine. It is time for the people to stand up and not wait on the police. We need prevention. We need the churches involved. We need Black Lives Matter involved. All these other organizations that's out here, we need you all to step up to the plate and take ownership of your city. And let's put some prevention things in place so that this won't happen again. And then we need the village to speak. We need us to get together like we did in the old days. We knew our communities. Our communities was okay with us disciplining each other and, and looking out for each other. I need us to go back to that moment. Somewhere in there, we have lost the, the village mentality. Families are hurting all across the city of Richmond. And with that, United Communities Against Crime believe there are some things that we are demanding that the police put into action immediately. I want to share some of those things with you. First, we believe that you must identify, address, and arrest the problems and the issues that are ill in our community. What I mean by that, we must verify and admit that there is a problem and there's an issue. We must also do not be afraid of those issues, but we must go at them hand in hand. Then we must implement those issues, execute the solutions, and follow up with them, with results. We must do that right away. We also at United Communities Against Crime recommend that all the businesses secure a letter of memorandum of understanding to address trespassing and laundering in your business. We are asking that you do that. We, are, we, we all are accountable for this. 